today. He is. Master. Startail Bomber. And in the bottom right, the greatest StarCraft One player of all time. He is... Master, KT Roaster Flash. Um, so, one thing we want to keep our eyes peeled for is any SCVs getting sent out to the middle of the map. Do mm -hmm. um, you think we're going to have a Reaper opening here, Artosis? Uh, Already Mictosis? You know, it, while it's possible, I'm not feeling Reaper for these guys right now for some reason. Like... I, I think Flash doesn't really need to open Reaper. Like, his builds are so good, his macro is so good, his defense is so good that yeah. he doesn't really need that. I don't know how much he's going to gain out of it. Yeah. Whereas with Bomber, I think he has to do something more powerful than a Reaper opening. A lot of this um, game will be decided um, with the first few Hellbat drops. Yeah. If you screw up with your SCV control, you can lose, like, a third of your workers. Yeah. Like, very quickly. So true. And then what happens is if you lose that big chunk, let's say in the first uh, drop that they have on you, you lose that. Then that means that you are so behind in resources that were coming in that you should have had that you don't have enough defense for the second drop. Mm. And it just starts to snowball. And then, um, you yeah, you just lose control of the game. And eventually your economy is so far behind the guys up, you know, two more bases than you and you lose. Yeah. Well, looks like we're going to have a pretty fast expansion here from Bomber. Flash. SCD chest bump there. Yeah. Flash is grabbing his gas. Uh, probably just going to go into a fast expansion and factory from there. And, uh, yeah, uh, we're going to have to wait and see where they're going to tech exactly. Mm -hmm. um, it looks like he should shut this, actually. <sighs> what? You know what? He wants well, him in. He says, come in. Come in, I want to kill You know, it's actually SCD. true. If he, bring, if he goes inside, he can actually close it and then yeah. kill him. Yeah. It's a trap. It's a trap. You don't want to do that. All right. We'll get out of there. All right, um, again, uh, it's basically to be expected that Hellbat drops are coming, but we have seen other strats used, but it's yeah, some kind of the, the, the standard bread and butter. Mm -hmm. You know, I did like uh, when we were seeing MVP uh, against Innovation uh, from the WCS Season Finals, where MVP was going for Hellions a bit, like Hellion with some Vikings to uh, deal with Hellbat drops, and I really wouldn't mind seeing something like that, but... Since Bomber had to switch his strategies back, I think we were going to see something pretty standard out of him. And yeah. for Flash, like, Flash is probably just going to macro up his, his Hellbat drops <laughs> very normally. Yeah. Now, um, on this map, because as you can see in the upper right side of the map and the bottom left, there's no way to put anything, at least ground-wise, down there to check for drops. Mm -hmm. So um, it's pretty easy to sneak in somebody's base and surprise him here. Yeah. All right, well, we do actually have the slightly quicker factory here for Bomber. Second gas is going down for both players as well. Command Center is pretty well lined up. Uh, nothing too special going on here. Both of them even getting their reactors going quite quickly. And so, uh, yeah, we're going to have to wait and see uh, when they do start to engage each other. Let's talk about something, Artosis. Well? I saw um, uh, Star Wars Empire Strikes Back yesterday. Oh, that's good. Yeah, you're going all through those again. Yeah, I've been, been watching a lot of Star Trek. Really? Yeah. Really? Yeah, I'm on a Star Wars yeah. phase right now. It's actually weird because I haven't watched... I mean, I, I guess I hadn't watched in years, you know? Yeah. And I had to see... I uh, oh, know, every that, now and then I just re That Yoda. Oh, yeah. It is kind of a... an income, when, they, when they get to the... What is that swamp planet? Dagobah, right? Dagobah system. Yeah, man. Yeah. Yoda's all, like, kind of weird... <laughs> Yeah, you know what I mean when, he, when, he, when he's talking, like he's sure. like whacking R two D two with the stick and yeah, stuff. Yeah, he's, he's a little bit wild. And he's like, no, he's like, I'm Yoda. Yeah, he's like, you need to be patient, Luke. Yeah, I'm, like, I'm, like, I'm like, weren't you just whacking the robot like <laughs> an hour ago? Like, it's kind of weird. It's how he relaxes. Uh, but it's now, uh, it's actually a good movie. I love it. I think it's the best Star Wars movie. It might be. It might be. That can be argued though. Now look at this. Flash actually has put Widow Mines very quickly on the side. Oh my God, this Wait, is actually awesome by Bomber. This is. Flash has put Widow Mines on the sides of his base. He scans, sees exactly what he expects for Hellbat drops, but it's double reactor factory. So we're actually probably going to see mass Hellions out of Bomber. This is really smart. This is an older strat. Yeah, this is something you almost never, never see. see. Like, ever. This is, this is awesome. And he's also... Because exactly what Flash scanned is exactly what he expects, but it's not what he thinks it is. Yeah. Now... This is a very mineral-intensive um, attack here. 
So you're going to crank out a bunch of them um, and hit the front right now and try to take out as many workers as possible. This is kind of an anachronistic build. We saw this a lot more in like year one of Wings of Liberty. Yeah. These phases where they just pool a bunch of Hellions and then just all of a sudden, yeah. if the other guy wasn't prepared, the damage output was just too high. This is such a cool build by Bomber. Really huge, huge kudos to him for trying this, man. This is really cool. Well, it's funny, too, because he said, okay, I don't know what I'm going to do now. I thought the patch was going to be out. No, this is... It's very MVP-esque, the way he's he's trying to go about this yeah. now. Let's see. The first Hellbat drop is coming. There's going to be a second rather quickly hey, here from Flash. You know Flash. what's smart about this is if Flash is making Hellbats, the Hellions are much more nimble. Yeah. They actually can completely avoid the Hellbats. Yeah, you can just kite them all day. Yeah. It's very true. Now, we do have a couple Vikings here waiting. Oh, my God. This could actually be really good for Bomber. If he slaughters his first drop and goes for a counterattack, oh. could work out. He's boosting the medevac now. Can he pull the SCVs out in time? No. No, he's <laughs> they, they, yeah, absolutely no. They didn't even move at first. Yeah. And he is going to lose this medevac pretty quickly here to three Vikings. So. How many kills was that there? Let's see. Uh, three. Three it, kills. So not bad. Is, it doesn't matter. That's fine. Now he takes out um, the Hellbats. And the Hellions are now going to move out. Now notice, he only used a, a, a little part of his army to defend mm -hmm. that. Yeah. He used what would look like a normal amount of Hellbats. But if this Wallen gets up... The Wallen oh, is it up. It is up. Excuse but me. But this is a lot of Hellions. 20 of them, in fact, coming up. You can't really repair against this. And in this fact, is the Wintermine taken out. Look at this. He's going to try to repair, but again, the you SCBs can't just get really killed. repair against this. Oh, and my God. And now it up, but it's too late. He's already done so much damage oh, here. Oh, man. And look at this. He's landing his Vikings as well. He's going to take out that bunker. A lot of SCVs going down. And Bomber looking like he might be able to just take this game Completely right away. Completely catching Flash off guard. If Bomber wins this series, he might end up having to thank the fact that he wasn't able to do what he prepared for. <laughs> Very well said, Tasis. Now this is going to be a very nice, uh, very nice victory if he gets it. Let's take a look. So far, 19 workers killed against five. Yeah. But right now, Flash is counter dropping. So there's still. This is not like the game is over yet. All right. He's landing the Vikings now up here. Any extra damage he can do is going to be worthwhile. Mm -hmm. And it looks like he's now destroyed that depot. And I. This might just be so much that he can't really stop it because all the rest of the SCBs well. are just down inside the main. If he gets over there, yeah. um, it's, just, it's just game over. Part of the problem is, though, Tasteless. Oh, God, yeah, I think I think Bomber has it, but there's still Hellbats in his base, so he has to be yeah. careful about so that. So we haven't actually caught, we haven't gotten a shot of this yet, but there are Hellbats actually wiping out Bomber's SCBs. Yeah, but this is too much. This is way too many Hellions, and it looks like every SCV going to fall. All right, Bomber, you got a proxy rack for the next game, and you win, man. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. All right, so this drop's been going on this whole time. So the economy here is really bad right now. Well, Flash's economy is non-existent. Non yeah, he's his income is down to basically nothing. Um, you know, wow. he, he can micro that that medevac as much as he wants with those two hellbats in it, man. But what a funny game, actually. Yeah. All right, GG. Well, well, well. It looks like uh, Bomber has had some good plans, maybe.